Hi all, it's Ben. I'm bringing you a follow-up review of this Ice Cool Reel laptop cooler. It's the one with six fans. I've already done a review on it. And unfortunately, I bought this in October and it stopped working last week. It's kind of unfortunate because I've already tried putting the USB on both of these and powering it up and it doesn't work anymore. What's strange is this little LED screen does come on and you can supposedly turn it off and on, turn up and down the fan, but as you can tell, the fan doesn't work on. The fans don't work, the lights don't work, and it just kind of died. I There's a one year warranty, so it should still be working into this October. And I reached out to their website, which I'll put right here. Left them a message, sent them an email, nothing. I know I read on Amazon that people said they have really great customer service. Unfortunately, not in my case. So the fans, I'm pretty sure, are still fine. And I suspect there's something wrong electrically with this connection all the way down to here. Because it does receive power, but the power isn't being sent to the fans or the lights. So there's probably something broken on the little circuit board in here. So I'm going to actually take this apart, hardwire it so that it, the fans just turn on as soon as you plug it in, because that's really what I only need it for. I don't need the lights and the bells and whistles. I don't even need the fans to be regulated to different speeds. I just want it to turn on and cool my laptop. So that's what I'm going to do. I'll show you the finished product. Keep in mind, when I do that, it will definitely void the warranty on this, but I paid about 39 I think about 30, 30 to 40 dollars for this so i had about nine good months of use out of it granted i should get a full year and unfortunately this company never got back to me so i'm just going to leave you an honest review that this is kind of a thumbs down that it died so soon i didn't abuse it i, I did use it every day though use it every day didn't bother with the lights but i did turn the fans on full power for all six so I know these fans, because I worked with computer fans before, have a very good long, like thousands of hours, thousands of hours of usage before they burn out. So this should still be well within their capability. I think it's just a craftsmanship and the soldering something broke. But I know these are all just wired to a circuit board, so I'm just going to hardwire it myself and uh, find the solution that way. So here's the finished product. I went ahead and screwed in the terminal block. Now you'll notice that actually A1 and B1 aren't used. It's because this fan, the wires were too short. And I could have taken another piece of wire and actually screwed it on or soldered it on, but I don't have a soldering iron to these shortened wires so that it would reach the terminal block. But I figure it already has five fans going for it. It'll have these two big ones, these two, and this guy, and this guy will just be static. Now this guy actually has the same length wire as this one, but the way it's positioned, it actually makes it easier to wire this guy up because in order for me to get it as close as possible, this actually ends up being too short. And if I clock it 90 degrees, it's still too short. So this will just be a spare in case this guy ever breaks. So I've went ahead and wired everybody up, wired it to this USB connector, it's existing. And now I'm going to plug it into my external power supply and make sure that it works. Now per the way this is designed, you can plug it into either one of these plugs. And I just wrapped it around with a lot of electrical tape. So I'm going to fire it up and it should start up. All right, cool. So the whole purpose is just to have these on all the time to provide, well, fans. 
to cool the uh, laptop. And remember, this, this thing I believe is faulty because this is the existing circuit board that sat at the top and it was just the wiring that came down. This guy actually turned on the LED, but then the power distribution from the USB to these six fans, as well as the lights, which I don't really care for, something was broken. I did call and con, I didn't call. I contacted their customer service. They never got back to me. I gave them a full week. And uh, so gotta say, it's kind of disappointing that this guy only worked for about nine months. And then now I had to kludge something together with this terminal block. And uh, well, it works for me. So I'll be back in action. I'll just put this plate back on, this, uh, this grill back on, and it should be good to go. So anyways, thanks for watching.